Hello everybody, welcome back to the Gratitude Incarnate Podcast. I'm your host, Amanda Rose, and this is the Daily Divine Download. Today I want to talk to you about something that I heard a lot when I was growing up. Have you ever heard anyone tell you, do as I say, not as I do? Maybe a parent, a grandparent, a teacher, a coach, an employer. I heard this a lot when I was growing up. But it never made much sense to me until I became a parent. You know, I learned that it is so much easier to tell others how to live rather than leading by example. If we want to teach anyone anything, we must learn that our actions are more powerful than our words. Our words do hold power, but nothing speaks louder than our actions. Sometimes as a parent, I observe my frustration with my child's actions only to realize that the person I am really frustrated with is myself. My child learned those actions from following my example. Think about this. When you learned how to walk, did you learn from words or actions? You were not taught to walk with verbal instruction. You were taught by observing others' actions, the act of walking. Words may have helped encourage you along the way, but you learn to walk by watching others' actions. It's time to change this paradigm of do as I say and not as I do. We must lead by our example. We must lead with actions more than words. If you want to teach your children, grandchildren, your students, your clients, your team members, you must lead by example. You are a physical manifestation of the results of your actions. For example, if you tell your child to shut up, you're teaching them this means that they must now be quiet because of your command. Your child will take this processed information out into the world as an example of how to command others to stop speaking to them. So they will begin to tell others to shut up to get them to stop talking. This is what you have taught them. Then what do you do typically? You get upset with the child for telling someone to shut up. But we must think back. Where did this child learn this behavior? Through observing the actions of you as the parent. So this means as the parent, you must lead with your actions. If you want your kid to get more exercise, then check in with yourself. Where are you giving them examples of working out? Where are they seeing positive results of working out in your life? Maybe you want your child to make more friends. Do you have friends? How do you treat those friends? Do you make an effort to have more friendships in your life? Maybe you want your child to eat healthier, but do they see you eating healthy meals? Maybe you don't have kids. Maybe your issue is with your team members at work. If they are not showing up consistently, ask yourself, Do you show up consistently or do you show up whenever you want to? Do you want them to stay and do you want them to stay on task and focus while at work? But do you stay on task and remain focused on your work all the time? Maybe it is your students. Maybe you're tired of students complaining about assignments, but then you start to complain when you grade papers. You know, no matter who you want to influence, know that this will be accomplished with your actions and the outcome you receive will be the consequence of those actions, okay? Don't worry though. We can have peace in knowing that we can change our reality anytime we choose. It's never too bad, it is never too late, and you are never too old. Your current reality is the residual effect of your past actions and circumstances. This means that if you begin now to change your actions, you can change your future, which will soon become your current reality. This is what makes life so magical and beautiful. I am so happy and grateful to be here with you today and to bring you this message. I'm here if you would like to work one-to-one with me with coaching or coaching in a group setting with the master class, I am here to get you these results. I want you to understand who you are on a deep personal level and I want you to create habits and a new mindset to realize your full potential. 
I want to show you how to create the life that you desire and deserve. Listen, I know from personal experience that no guide is needed for this journey, but a coach can show you how to get the results you want at quantum speeds. I want you to get these results in four weeks. And if you're ready for even more massive results, then I'll encourage you to join the VIP program. I am offering this program so you can go beyond that to levels beyond your wildest dreams. In the VIP, I am giving you everything I have got, every tool in my kit, every bit of wisdom I have received on my journey, and I am handing you my blueprints to the abundant life that you were born to live. I am obsessed with celebrating others and their success in life. This is what life is all about, enjoying this magical and beautiful experience. This is my mission and my passion to raise the vibration of this whole planet through gratitude, showing the world that if we all get better as individuals, we get better collectively. That's it for today, guys. That's what I'm going to leave you with. Thank you so much for joining me on this journey. It means so much to me and I will forever and always be grateful to you for that. So with all that being said, I want you to have a grateful day and I will talk to you tomorrow.